Okay, so today we're gonna make this liquid background animation in After Effects. Let's go to the new composition. I gotta go with 1080p, click OK. I gotta create a new solid, right click, new solid. And I gotta go and type into the effects and presets gradient. And we got here the four color gradient, the drag and drop on the solid. Now I gotta pull this little dots somewhere in the center, bring close to the center here, like that. I gotta change the first color, I gotta make it this strong blue, click OK. I gotta make the second one white. Third one is gonna be a red pink. I gotta click OK and the fourth one is gonna be a purple. Click OK. Let's create an adjustment layer, right click, new adjustment layer. And I gotta search for turbulence displacement. Let's drag and drop the turbulence displacement on the adjustment layer. Increase the size all the way up. Decrease the amount, so around 40, complexity a maximum. And we're gonna change up the turbulence to a vertical displacement. You're also gonna see some black spots. We're gonna adjust that. I'm gonna go and type into the effects and presets, motion tile. Drag the motion tile above the turbulence displacement. And I'm gonna check the mirror edges and increase the output width and the output height. I'm gonna go some like this. I also gotta go to the turbulence displacement evolution. I'm gonna press and hold alt and click on the stopwatch. And I'm gonna type in time asterisk 100. Now I'm gonna go and search for CC smear drag and drop under turbulence displacement and you got two dots in here where you can reposition them i gotta drag it some like this and increase the radius all the way to a thousand and it's gonna create some nice waves i gotta press ctrl d on the cc smear to create a new duplicate and i'm gonna pull the circle here and the left one somewhere around on the left somewhere around in the opposite direction there you go i also gonna search for the twirl effect drag and drop the twirl under the smear and i'm gonna twirl it like this and now i'm gonna start animating the cc smear both of them so i'm gonna activate the stopwatch from and the two and i also gonna activate the stopwatch at the first cc smear from and two i'm gonna go to the second second and i'm gonna click on the first cc smear and start Pulling these, some like this. I gotta go to the second CC smear. I don't even know. I think this is gonna be pretty decent. So it's creating a nice animation. And this was it. Thanks for watching.